Hello YouTubers, I have a Canon PowerShot SX50HS camera that I bought several years ago and it has been great for taking pictures but lately I've been using it, I start using it for my YouTube videos especially the shots that I've been doing outside with motorcycles as well as with RC airplanes and I have been getting a lot of wind noise so it has a little um, microphone over here if you can see it it's built-in microphone and it's terrible whenever you have some wind it's just going to cut off your whatever voice you have and I had uh, some comments on my videos like hating me for not using uh, Lavalier microphone so I've been researching it and I couldn't find anything so I'm going to try to shed some light into this mystery of if this PowerShot SX50HS can take a microphone or not. I have uh, watched two videos made by the same person uh, on the two different uh, YouTube channels and he claims that it can take it but as you see like this is the little um, opening that gives you access to these three interfaces. The top one if you look here looks like a microphone symbol and people have been trying to use that without any success and then there is AV out digital this is a mini USB and on the bottom there's the HDMI so most people have tried this one and I'm going to show what happens if you try to you know put in a microphone in that hole so let me turn this on take the cap off so you can see and if you try a regular 3.5 millimeter jack, it's, it doesn't fit. So this is TRS 3.5 millimeter jack, and it doesn't it doesn't fit. So it, need, it takes something smaller. So I was scratching my head, you know, what kind of microphone do I need there? I had this Boyfun action camera that I got from Amazon, and it has been working great. And one of the reasons it was working great, it, it has a it came with a microphone. And it has a microphone jack here, so uh, I don't rely on the built-in microphone. So I can just plug this in, put this on my helmet on top, and then I can just run this through my helmet and put it inside close to my mouth, and it will record everything on the video. So I don't have to any synchronization with my by recording my voice on my phone. So I thought that this had a like a smaller jack. I don't know what type it is. But I said maybe this will work and I'm going to show you what happens when you put that into that port. So I'm going to just plug this little jack into that port, top port, that people thought was uh, the microphone port. It, it just took a picture and it's frozen right now. So I'm going to pull it out, comes back to life and then do it again. So you, when you plug in, it in, it just takes a picture. So I'm, I'm guessing this is actually for a clicker, cable clickers. That's what I'm guessing. I haven't uh, looked into the manual. Anyway, I was surfing on, on, on the internet and looking at YouTube videos and this gentleman uh, just says that you can get an adapter, mini USB adapter, like this one I got from Amazon. So, but what he was saying is you can get one of these adapters so what these adapters do is, one end plugs to this to this port that's AV out digital. So this end goes in, and the other end has a 3.5 millimeter TRS port. So you can just plug in a Lavalier Lapel microphone. All right, so I'm going to try it out now if it works or not for one, once and for all so I'm just going to need these pieces so this goes in here and then the USB mini USB and goes here is this on maybe turn this up off okay now it's on let's see if it's going to do anything strange when I plug that in no, it hasn't done anything strange. That's a good thing. 
Now I have to test it for the sound. See if it's going to make a difference. So I'm going to take this off and I'm going to start recording. So it's recording now. I'm testing the sound without the microphone. And now I'm attaching. Now I'm testing the sound with the lapel microphone. I'm talking to this now. With about the, without the lapel microphone. Test, test, test. Attaching it again. With the lapel microphone. Test, test, test. So now I'm ne I need to stop this, take the memory card to my computer, and see if there's any difference. So it's recording now. I'm testing the sound without the microphone. And now I'm attaching. Now I'm testing the sound with the lapel microphone. I'm talking to this now. With about the, without the lapel microphone, test, test, test. Attaching it again. With the lapel microphone, test, test, test. So now I'm need, I need to stop this, take the memory card to my computer, and see if there's any difference. So I played the video I just took on my computer and I did not hear any difference when I without and with the microphone whatsoever. So I don't think it's working, but I just want to make sure that um, it's really not working and I'm not doing something wrong. But I just want to double check again and this time uh, simulating wind. So I have this little fan and I'm going to start it up. It's going to make the wind noise and then I'm going to turn this on. I pulled it out so it's without. And let me take my hand off this side because this is where the built-in microphone is. So it's just in the direct path of the air blowing from the fan. And I'm going to start recording. All right, I'm recording in the windy conditions and without the microphone. Now I'm going to attach the microphone. It's attached. Check, check. In the windy conditions with the microphone. Unplugged it. Without the microphone. I plugged it back in, as you can see, with the microphone. Check, check with the microphone. Okay, I can turn this off now. And stop the video. Yeah, I don't think this is working out, but I'm going to turn this off again. And go test the video that I just took. Wish me luck, although I don't think it's working. Alright, I'm recording in the windy conditions and without the microphone. Now I'm going to attach the microphone. It's attached. Check, check. In the windy conditions with the microphone. I'm sorry to say this, but it's definitely not working. At least the way I tried it, uh, it's not working. So you, you watch the video and you can barely hear my voice. And this is not, this thing is not that strong and the wind wasn't that bad.
But uh, I mean, I, it, it completely blocked my voice, the wind noise. And this adapter didn't do anything. Basically, it was useless. Unless I'm missing something in terms of setting it up properly, maybe from the menu. But that person who made two videos and posted on two different YouTube channels. Yeah, I don't know why someone will make a video saying that, oh, okay, so this is working but he doesn't try it out in his own videos and just saying, hey, this works, you know, I, I use it all the time. Very unfortunate. I was hoping to be able to use this camera for all my recordings and then voice will be on the video. But now I have to probably use my cell phone to record my voice separately and then synchronize with the video later. And by the way, I just want to try this one on my phone. <laughs> Test, test, test without the microphone on, so I'm going to connect it. Test, test, test with, with the microphone connected to my phone. Test, test without the microphone I'm holding in my hand. Now it's time to actually test these microphones with the wind. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to connect one of them to my phone. Connected, test, test. So, I, and then now I'm going to create the wind by turning this on. So, wind is on, it's blowing at the highest. Test, test. Is this working? Is this working? I hope so. Now it's off. Test, test. Without the wind down, now I'm turning the wind back on. The wind is on. Is it working? I hope so. <laughs> All right, let's turn it off and watch the video. Well, this at least shows that this microphone is not the culprit, so it is working. And while the, on the bright side, I have now two of these microphones. Right now, actually, I, one of them I'm already using it with my phone when I'm recording this. So it's working great, and I have the Y adapter and extension. So from now on, I'm going to uh, record my voice. Whenever I have these videos, I'm going to record my voice on my phone and then synchronize the voice recording with the video later. So at least I will have higher quality sound and I won't get comments or hate comments saying, oh, that, that sound uh, was terrible, the wind, you know, I couldn't hear you. All right. Well, I'm learning. I'm new to this, so I'm learning. I hope this helps. If you have especially one of these, well, I like the pictures, I like the video. The sound sucks, but there are always ways, ways around it, so, but this was not one of them. This was not the way, so I can throw it out. Well, take care, and see you next time. Thanks for watching.